time, the one thing even the smartest humans can't control. Want to sort a billion numbers, classical computers, they'll take years. But what if I told you, quantum could do it in seconds? Let's start small, two qubits, combine them, boom, four-dimensional states. Zero, 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 one, one, zero, one, one. A universe in four dimensions. But humans, we're stuck in three dimensions. We can't even visualize it. Classical algorithms, they're like untangling spaghetti. Bubble sort, two loops, O of N squared time. Nested, clunky, painfully slow. But merge sort, smarter, O of N log N. Still, not enough. Enter quantum, superposition, entanglement, interference. Instead of checking paths one by one, check them all at once. Grover's search, square root of N speed. Shor's algorithm, cracks encryption exponentially faster. Quantum doesn't just speed things up, it rewrites the rules. Simulating molecules, sorting galaxies of data, classical billions of years, quantum minutes. This isn't just computing, it's a time machine. Will we beat time? Not yet. But with tensor products, entanglement and a dash of quantum magic, we're getting closer. The future isn't waiting. Credits none provided.